Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I have another LOL surprise unboxing video. This one features the new Crayola series and it is the Color Me Studio capsule. The capsule itself is shaped like a crayon, like the little pencil sharpeners that would come in the, the boxes, which I think is super cute. It opens up to reveal your mini doll. You also get four different colored crayons, as well as 20 paper fashions that you can design and decorate for your doll, which I think is a totally cute concept for the Crayola series. These retail for $14.99 each, and I picked mine up at Target on a recent toy hunt. Target has a ton of new merchandise out right now, which is really awesome. So if you're new to my channel, welcome. We're a collector hobby and review channel. And of course, if you like what you see, feel free to subscribe. Let's go ahead and get started. This capsule is absolutely adorable. Look at how magical all those colors are. <laughs> they did a great job, and this becomes like your little storage capsule and carrying case, and it even folds out where you can hang some of the clothes. It looks like you get some other accessories. Your crayons can go in there. Oh, that is so cool. Love the zipper pull as well. Okay, so let us see if our color of the crayon should, should reveal what we get. Oh, okay, this comes off. Okay, so I think you can just push up because when I was grabbing it, it, it came off like so. Oh, how cute. We have a pink crayon. Oh, and that's part. Okay, so there's everything off like that. Oh my goodness, it does remind me of those sharpers. <laughs> that is so cute. We got some bows and designs and then you just open it up to reveal what's inside. Let me maybe lift the lid. Yes. Okay. So there's that, and you have your little dresses, your 20 different fashions. So they do have different designs, so you get a couple couple of each, perhaps. Got some patterns, ooh, that's pretty. Especially if we have a pink, I might save that one. Oh, the little hearts are cute. I'm curious how these are gonna just kinda fold on your doll. Got some other designs. Oh, and then some blank ones. Oh, that's really cool. So then you can just make them whatever you like. Oh, that's cool. You can make them into like holiday designs, different seasonal items, favorite things. Okay, that's that's kind of cool. They, they definitely give you a variety, which I appreciate. Oh, and I realize we have the color Radical Red. Oh, that's, that's going to be fun. And this part, after much struggling, <laughs> this white piece here does pull off. So that way you can then open your crayon and then there's this little notch that you pull towards you and voila oh that's cool so we have our blind bag okay that's a pretty color we got a bunch of blind bags so many blind bags and then we have our series of colors and then here is the checklist this unfolds as well to make your little closet okay that's adorable so well themed and again it's all inside the crayon which is on brand since we know our color of the crayon i'll save the checklist for last once we open everything so you can put the crayons inside there that's really cute i loved like the little caddies like the crayola caddy where your crayons stand up Ooh, so pretty so we have the razzle dazzle rose which is awesome sun glow which is such a pretty name shocking pink and the radical red so you can line those up there and then this part you can use as sort of like a stencil it gives you two sides that you can um, color like the blank design on it's kind of hard to see but those are little hearts and keys and then this is like a filigree pattern so that's kind of neat and then our first little baggie has the handles that go up top as well as your little hanger clips for the clothes okay that's cute that opens up almost like a almost like a hair clip and you can clip your little clothes and hang them up here i like that design i wonder if they'll do that for more series and then this snaps together and goes up top here and then next up we have oh my goodness we have like a little matching mini one but it's their little bag oh it has a bow does it open up oh it does it's definitely a, a soft plastic too i noticed that when i opened the crayola capsules that everything feels a little like softer and squishier <laughs> including their outfits and the dolls themselves so we'll see if this this doll does too but i'm really really loving the bag 
then oh yeah this is the base for your doll to stand and it goes it snaps in up top there next item oh cute it's a little crayola cupcake you get you get a food item what <laughs> that is so cute so it has our little pink wrapper little cupcake and sprinkles with a heart on top Okay, I wasn't expecting that one. That's adorable. You know I love my, my mini food items. <laughs> and then our next accessory are the shoes. Very cute pink shoes with a little white socks and a black heel. And then this one looks to be some glasses. Come on out. Ah, oh, they're heart glasses. Okay. That's really cute. And then here is our doll. Again, love love the packaging on these. And oh my goodness, look at the colors. How cute. So she comes dressed in a little shirt and shorts. With, again, that Crayola stripe there. That's awesome. Super pretty pink hair. Oh, also with a little Crayola headband that is actually molded to the doll. And then how adorable. So here she is with all her accessories, and her name is Rad Red Cutie. I like how everything comes together. Now, you'll design the dress that actually goes on her, so they don't come with like a separate plastic outfit, but the accessories are a lot of fun. And then, of course, we'll, we'll use our crayons to make a nice combo, and I do like how they, they give you four different colors. There are eight dolls total in the Color Me Studio. So we have a Razzle Dazzle Rose Girl. Oh, that's pretty. And then Outrageous Orange Gamer. She does come with a game controller. That is adorable. Then we have Sun Glow Sweetie. I like the little strawberry shirt. We have Granny Smith Apple Gardener. I like the little flower tiara. We have Aquamarine Miss. On this side, Fuchsia Friend. I thought I was going to say Fuchsia Fiend, and I was like, oh, she's the spicy one of the group. It says friend, not fiend. <laughs> what, what am I thinking? Shocking Pink rock star. Oh, she comes with a little guitar. And then here is our Rad Red Cutie. And I noticed that there's no rarity designation anywhere on the checklist, unless I'm majorly missing something. So they might all be an even chance per box. I've selected three different dresses that I will decorate off screen with our crayons and we'll see how they how they look. They have a little button which is like giving me Lala Loopsy vibes and then you can attach them like this when you cut a little slit. So that's cool. Let's let me get the coloring. Okay, so here are my three different designs. I think I like this one the best. This one I did by doing the little stencils. So just putting that over there. It kind of has like the heart and lock design like this one I chose too. I realize crayons get like the color like greasiness that kind of builds up so th this one probably is my least favorite that I did but it's a lot of fun and I just stuck to the colors they gave you but feel free to to mix it up and come up with some really cool creations I do like how the colors they gave you kind of complement your doll very well so we'll we'll stick with that and it looks like you're just going to slip their arms through you want to make sure you fold it a certain way. Oh, you don't want to tear. Okay, that could be a could be a problem. Okay, so if you move their arms a little bit closer together, it's easier to do. Oh, and then her hair catches. There we go. So it's kind of like this smock dress. There's already a slit cut for you, so you just need to kind of weave that through. Oh, this is going to take me a minute. <laughs> okay, so that, that lines up like so. You can give it a press if, if needed. And then, voila, there is, there is your dress. It's not too form-fitting, but it's a really cute concept to, to make your own little paper dress. And then you would just remove it and clip it into the hangers. And it shows you how to press it into the hanger and then click it closed. So it must um, make an indentation for, for the next time. So that kind of cinches it together like so. And it will stay like that and you can hang it up in your closet. Here's dress number two. 
the stencils actually turned out pretty cute and I realize now so I'm just leaving it with their enclosure but you can try to like cinch it to maybe tighten up the dress like a little bit more <laughs> that, that looks a little bit better in my opinion so maybe with some some tape you can kind of tailor it she she needs a little bit more tailoring to the clothes and then here is the last dress I actually like the the angles on this dress but again a little a little cinching at the waist could could make it lay flatter like that looks really cute and I put a little tape on back which with the crayons it it'll be easy to peel off so that actually worked and I definitely like that look a little bit better although this isn't my favorite one I made but that's okay <laughs> we'll, we'll go back through the others Feel free to let me know your thoughts on the Crayola Color Me Studio series, or you can let me know which doll out of all the different colors are you most interested in finding. I do love all, all the pretty matching colors. As for me, I love purple, and I would love to find Fuchsia Friend, or Fuchsia Fiend, as we, we like to call her now. <laughs> she looks really cute. And look at the little Crayola crayon bow she's wearing. Overall, I think no matter what your age, it is fun to pick up a crayon and color. So that, that definitely brings back memories. I know one of you mentioned in my previous video that just seeing these made you want to color. And I just think that's awesome. Crayons are a lot of fun. Coloring is relaxing. And I had a, a good time designing those dresses. And you get so many more to design. <laughs> There's lots. So they do give you that. I think my only... Um, critique would, would be for the $14.99 price point, can, can we have some just regular clothes for the doll <laughs> just in case we don't want to wear the paper dresses? That, that's all. And that'll do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it or found it useful for your own shopping. If you did, feel free to give it a thumbs up and I want to thank you so, so much for watching. I really appreciate it and I hope to see you in the next one. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.